Hi there, this is the Sony PXW FS7 and I'm sure one of the first things you budding filmmakers are going to want to do with it is capture the raw 4K output out of it and for which you'll need this, which is the XDCA, I think, back on the uh, dock thing on the back of the FS7 and uh, an external recorder which is capable of taking that signal such as this, the Odyssey 7Q. Now the first thing to do is plug your 7Q uh, into the back of the raw output on the back of the FS7's dock there. Um, make sure it's a you know 3G cable, by the way. It's got to be the right cable, otherwise it can muck up the recording on the 7Q. So the first thing we want to do is set up the frame recording rate inside the camera. So let's go down to user, make sure our area is set correctly. Shooting mode, Cine EI, and it will say to execute that, so we'll execute that. Takes a minute or two every time you change one of these modes. So we can see now we're in S Gamma 3, S Log 3. Now let's go back. So that was base setting. Now we're going to go to record format. You can see it's uh, by default at the UHD or QFHD as it really is. And we're going to go right to uh, well, let's go right to 50p 4K and execute that. Looks good. Okay, now back again. Now we need to set up the actual outputs from the XDCA here to make sure that the port is actually giving out the full 4K RAW. So this is back to the main menu and we're going to go right to the bottom to system. And you can see there's the system menu, the base setting Kodak, you might think you're in the top menu or not, you're in the bottom settings menu. Now we want to change the codec in here to RAW. So you can see we've got the option of RAW only, so it's only sending RAW out of the terminal, or we can do RAW and XAVC, MPEG, etc. So it will simultaneously send the RAW 4K out of here whilst recording HD internally in here, which is really, really useful. So we're going to do internal recording and RAW. Execute. OK, and we can now leave the menu. Now it's time to set up the Odyssey 7Q. So let's have a look here. Camera, Sony FS7. Select that from the list. And we're going to 4K RAW to 4K ProRes. Because I'm a Mac user and it will take a second or two to boot up in the new 4K RAW recording mode and it gives you the warning which is quite helpful for FS7 4K RAW to ProRes, FS7 colour space must be S Gamut 3 Cine S Log 3 only which is quite helpful so uh, we'll say OK to that. So there we are that was how to quickly set up the 4K RAW output from this thing the XDCA FS7 to something like the Odyssey 7Q there for to get the absolute maximum bit rate, the maximum dynamic range, the maximum quality from the FS7.